Hey everyone, how's it going? Ah, today I'm back out at the D8K, filled it up with some fuel. Uh, as I said before in the, in the other video, uh, I picked this up at an auction about two, three weeks ago. Yeah, three weeks ago. Uh, I just wanted a bigger cat. Our six was a little too small for, for some of the stuff we were doing. Like, we didn't do too much stuff big, like knocking down trees and everything with it. But, you know, when it came time to do it, it was... It was too hard, like you had to climb halfway up a tree to knock it down, especially any kind of 10 inch, 12 inch poplar. Or, uh, I didn't really knock down any spruce or anything, but so yeah, I, we were thinking of getting an eight, and uh, we looked at a few of them. And you know, I probably could have got a couple of them cheaper, but I picked up this one, and it's all been repainted, so that's a plus. Uh, like I said before. <laughs> The only thing that's, you know, the the undercarriage, some of the rollers, the rollers could be changed. They're not bad. This one needs to be changed. That one definitely. It's got a flat spot in it. It was probably stuck or froze and they ran it like that. So, yeah. The pins, are, the pins aren't too bad. A little bit of water on them. Uh, the sprockets, sprockets are sharp, you know, they shouldn't be that sharp, eh? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy the segments and take off the covers and just install them. And then you drive the cat forward and put the next one on. So that's easy, easy enough. Uh, yeah, uh, the guy, the guy I have hired to run it was already doing a little bit of work with it. Uh, there was a uh, kind of a low spot with trees here, and when we were bailing, we used to come around, and go around this way, and then back up this way. So now, after we get it cleaned out, you can just go right through straight. There's a cool height. I pushed the, that one down there in the winter. There, I pushed that one over there in the winter. So you can burn those. I was pushing that one down. That's hard there. There's some big trees in there. Nothing for this thing though. Uh, there's a section way down there has a little bit of bush he wants to push that down this is not my land this is a rented land and the, the guy I got driving or running the cat is the owner of the place so uh, in the future I do plan to buy this ground hopefully for a good price it's it's actually two quarters it's 260 acre quarters uh, the ending is actually right there of the one quarter, right where those spruces are. So I'm on the second quarter, and this quarter is like, this end quarter has got a lot of hills in it. So yeah, and my video is doing funny things. Anyways, yes. So I don't know what happened there. So yeah, uh, uh. I'm gonna I plan to just leave it here for a while I don't know if I'm gonna take it home but it's, uh, my place is about six miles down the road so yeah nothing really I can do right now it's a big rain they were forecasting it's more the rain is more up north uh, about an hour up north I guess they're really getting it up there about uh, they said rainfall warnings for 60 millimeters 60 70 mils and uh, 100 mils is, 100 millimeters is four inches so you can figure out that from there so it'll be about two two and a half three, almost three inches that's don't need that right now so yeah i'm gonna go find something else to do so thanks for watching